Back at with your boys, Cass and Dom. Ladies and gentlemen, we finally got the Renji gameplay for all of you. Hopefully you guys will enjoy it. You guys will see my accessories, they are OP. Not really. That is the most amount of SP I could get on this Renji. Because my mini account, as you know, is now back in action running recharge first. And I'm going to tell you right off the bat that this Renji is amazing. Alright, he may not be the best at everything else, but in PvE, he rocks. Where do I hold him? As it comes to like him versus Tosho, you can't recompare really the two because Tosho got the ice and everything else. But this Renji, boy, does he put in that work. This isn't me forwarding the gameplay, by the way. This is actually Renji is moving. He's actually moving around. This is his actual speed. Where Tosho a bit, I'm um, a slow, a bit sloppy. This Renji is going full force. Look at that. He don't even have long stride. Imagine if he had long stride. But his attack, and not only that, his third strong attack with the charge up does. Crazy damage, check it out for yourself. Watch this. Oh God! Up to 8,000, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, that's including the frenzy and everything else, but he does that damage. He does a lot of work. You're gonna be seeing a few gameplays on this one. You're gonna see a full strong attack on the on the next one. We've got hybrid and we've got normal attack damage just for the sake of it. Gonna run with a gold champion and everything and see how he does. But man, this recharge and this Renji, Renji recharge, double R, it works. I like it. I you I'll use him a lot more than I use Tosha right now, and, but the crazy thing is I don't have Tosha on this account, so I really can't do a a player versus player game with you guys. But maybe I can do a comparison down the line. But yes, Renji, good job, PVE definitely one of the best. For me, definitely one of the best. His normal string, he's got the three hits and his fourth of his normal string multiple times he'll hit. You'll see it. You'll, you'll see it especially on the normal attack damage gameplay. But this charge up was so much fun. Look at the time as well. It doesn't even take hardly any time that attacks are back. Your first, second strong attack. I'm, look at I'm on the boss already. This is what I'm talking about. This is good. I enjoyed playing with this Renji a lot. See, I had to wait for the charge up. He ain't touching me. Well, put that damage in. I missed Renji completely, but it's alright. I'm going with the special. You won't be able to see the damage of the special because that's on screen. I'm not using attention tie. So you won't really see a full output of damage on this gameplay. But along these gameplays, you're going to see an insta-kill. Oh, that was insta-kill then. That right there. And by the way, and his Renji. What am I talking about? He also, the special, has a chance of insta-kill. That's what makes him so special. Is that what Toshiro doesn't have. But then Toshiro can nuke. So can this Renji. Yeah! So there you go. Recharge. First gameplay. What do you guys think? Is that how he should be built? Is that how you're building Renji? Let me know a comment section below. All right, keep in mind he also has a run car killer. He and I'll try to find the right gameplay to do, but there's not a run car to kill the last two days. But two days, yeah. I'm looking for raids, couldn't find them. Using the strong, strong attack damage links. And again, we're gonna run the SP, same build as before, but without the recharge. How is he gonna do? You're about to find out. Charge up attack first to see what kind of range he covers. So go in the middle. Look at that. 10k with the strong attack charge up. Second strong attack hitting about 6,000. Man, I, I can't really fault this Ranger too much. I mean, I, I did try to hybrid as well. You're going to see for yourself in the next gameplay. But I just feel like these characters who have got charge up, they, their potential is amazing. They can work in PvP. I mean, because I don't have Tosha on here, I haven't really run any PvP other than me just, just messing around the other day. I had all three of them in, in my PvP team. It was only for a laugh, by the way, all right? It wasn't serious, guys, so don't get too serious. I mean, it can work. Maybe Rookie out of the three could make it in the team because she's basically immune to freeze. So Toshiro against her, most likely she will win. If you, I mean, if you're serious about PvP, I'd say open up um, uh, Rukia's down your Blood Bowl Rukia. Open up a Soul Tree, uh, six star, then um, uh, then a Soul Lynx, max them out 10, 10, 10, and give her the best links possible. And trust me, you will not be disappointed. She will definitely hold her own. Um, if you're going to run her alongside Onohana, I say that's the best way to do it. If you have Onohana, I'm thinking about this. Don't when is the Thousand Year Blood Bowl Round 2 ever going to come back? Because that's what I'm most looking forward to. Because I want her to come back. Because I want a summon. I need her on this account. If I could pull her on this account as well, for me, that would be the ultimate. I won't really be after the Toshio too much. Just the Onohana. I really want Onohana. I mean, Banken, I already have him. I've got three of them. But what do you do with bank ends? You've got three. Do you put one into the other? Because I haven't done it yet. Is it worth doing? You think so? I think I'm keep one for Link. Yeah? Just in case, down the line. Keep one for Link. Maybe I'll do the other one. I'll put 
one into the other and see how that works out. All right, damage wise, what are we saying, Renji? I don't know if I want, I didn't one shot him because I didn't have tension tie. I didn't one shot him here. This is a full protection strong attack with no tension tie. Okay, seven and a half. I have to do one real quick again. So yes, so the first gameplay, it was definitely insta kill. I can say that for sure. But give it up for the animation. The animation is insane. I don't, I don't skip it for, for a reason because it looks so good. All right, what do you guys think? Strong attack damage, good, bad. He's still leaning towards the hybrid. I mean, say the recharge. Is that what you're still leaning towards? It's all right. Next one is gonna be the hybrid build. That's the one I want you guys to see. Is this Renji a hybrid character? Let's find out. What we're gonna use for accessories and for links. I'm gonna show you guys. It should have been 14, by the way. That should have been 14 recharge. I'm just saying. All right, we're gonna use a Yuki. You guys know how that goes down. Got the SP on there. So that's 50% right there. Gonna use um, the bait. It's got 20% SP. And it's got the 30% attack, and we're gonna use the coin with 10% also, 15% attack. So basically, I've got more SP on there than attack, but I'm trying to do as much as I can. I'm gonna use links of oh, Renzu 25% NAD, Kyan 25% strong attack. Here we go. Normal attack damage. Okay. We're popping off from about two and a half thousand with a normal string. Charge of attack is gonna hit four. Four and a half thousand. Hit twice for, um, uh, because he's got frenzy. That's about 9,000 right there. That's not bad. I mean, it's, it's looking good right now. It's looking good right now. But it's just the amount of time it takes for the strong attacks to come back. Then you've got to use a normal string. 2,500, but it kills him. And keep in mind, this is a 5-star raid as well. It's that last string of his normal attack. Which hit multiple times. So I think it goes anywhere up to um, 1,500. All the way up to 3,500. Which is good. The strong attack right there. Now we're getting up to the good numbers. 9,000. With the charge up attack. Again, this Renji, I find him to be really good. He, he could be one of, the, one of one of the best recharge characters. I did say one of, I didn't say the. If I say the, I know what you guys are gonna do. You're gonna go to the comment section and go, nah, Tasha is still number one because he's not freeze, he's the old, I know, but still, I'm, I'm gonna rate this Renji quite high because I just feel like he is a lot of fun to play with. I've been telling Dom about him for the last two days. You gotta pull this Renji, bro. No, I'm not lying, you gotta pull it. You see, you see it for yourself. You gotta pull this Renji. Have you got Renji on both, JP and Global? Have you got Toshio, Toshio, Toshio? You have, I oh, think you probably won't leave him. But he's still good, I'm, st I'm telling you, he's still good. He, maybe he wouldn't have been so good if he didn't have the third charge of attack, but he does. And I think that's what's pushing me more towards Renji than, than Toshio. But take a look, damage is there. Getting up to 5,000 with his first strong attack. Charge up is getting up there as well, multiple hits. I feel like one time there was about 15,000 damage. Again, I, I rate this Renji highly, man. Here we go. Coming up to the boss again. No tension tie. Um, again, I wasn't trying to see how big he hit for special on hybrid. It was just strong attacks mainly. Here we go. Point that now. Damage. I can't remember if I finished in one shot here or not. Let's see. No. Okay. The damage is about almost 7,000. <laughs> so that, that was good. That's good. Yeah. Finished him. What do you guys think? Good? Bad? Didn't like it? Don't like the hybrid? I know some of you guys are going to like the hybrid build. But here's the question. How did you guys even do in summoning, by the way? I mean, if you've got Renji, I don't think you should be disappointed. For real, I don't think you should be disappointed whatsoever. Great character PvE. Here we go. Last gameplay. It's going to be normal attack damage. You guys know how it goes down. What we got, Cass? Show us. What's the build? Gold Chappy, max attack. Five star Chappy, 20% attack. We got the robe as well with 30% attack. That ain't bad. Links, all 25, right across the board. Here we go. Damage time. All right. About 5k. We're starting off with 5k, ladies and gentlemen. He is quick. He is nimble. He will get through this. No problem. I'm telling you right now. I'm only going to be trying to use strong attack if I get into a little bit of trouble or I'm trying to break guard. That's the only time you're going to see me throw down a strong attack. But look at that, 6k Dom. It's that last one. I was trying to, I think I was trying to balance out. There you go. Multiple times. Over 2,000 multiple hits. So uh, what, about three to four times the last attack hits, right? Yeah, about four times. So that's 8k. That's not bad, right? I mean, yeah, his first um, a couple of uh, hits don't do as much. They do 5,000. 
last one kept 8,000. I think that's good. I mean, it's, it's not it's not crazy level. It's not like Ichigo or Uryu level, but that damage is still there. And he runs for it quick. Strong attack, break guard. I think this is quicker though. I mean, this is quite quick. Unless you're going to run in full recharge, this isn't a bad build. Again, it's not the most fun. Again, people say that normal attack damage characters aren't the most fun. Um, have you seen Ichigo? I'm just saying. <laughs> if he gives his enemy a chance to come inside the screen, first thing. If you put an auto, watch Ichigo. He will not let the enemy show up inside the screen. He's shooting outside the screen to finish him off. That's what's so crazy. But uh, out of the three characters, um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it like this. Ichigo, um, fun to play with. Renji, destruction. Rukia, fun with freeze. That's what I'm going to say. Freeze fuck. Because she got that. On top of that, and being immune to freeze against Toshiro. I mean, come on now. Give it up. All right, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Here I'm uh, coming up to the boss right now. You guys have seen it. What do you guys think out uh, of the four gameplays? Which is your favorite? How should it be built? Let us know in the comment section below. And best of luck if you guys are still summoning for these characters. And hopefully you guys pull what you guys want. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, please go ahead right now and smash that like button. Share this video with your friends and family. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Because that's your boy Don. This is your boy Cass. Where? Out. This is your boy, that's way out.